Hello friends see you again with me Supercar. In this video I will review the 2023 Honda Pilot Trail Sport. Watch the video until it's finished so that you find out what has been upgraded to the 2023 Honda Pilot Trail Sport car. Continue to support the Supercar channel by liking, commenting, subscribing, and tapping the bell so you get other latest car videos. Honda has released a much more revealing teaser image showing more of the new 2023 Honda Pilot design. Honda has previously shown a camouflage version from afar, but these latest photos reveal much of the three-row crossover's new design which includes a larger grille, square headlights and tail lights, and a new bright blue color. On this video review is the Trail Sport trim level, which was first introduced in the outgoing Pilot and the smaller Passport, but will include more intensive customization in the new model. Honda says the additions will consist of all-terrain tires, skid plates, suspension modifications, and a more advanced all-wheel drive system. Honda is proud to say that the newly debuted fourth-generation Pilot is the biggest and most powerful SUV it has ever built. Yes, of course isn't that what pilots always do? Not wanting to steal the Honda spotlight too much, the 2023 Pilot is a handsome machine that comes with more room for passengers and cargo, a new V6 engine, and a sturdier trail sport trim level with improved off-road capabilities. Dimensions only tell part of the story. The new look features straighter proportions, blending the squared profile of the second generation pilot with the more organic shape of the third generation. Up front is the largest that Honda has ever produced, which encloses the engine bay in a clamshell design. Also up front is a new honeycomb grille and angular headlights with equally new LED headlights. The new 2023 Pilot to Honda's next-generation light truck platform, which features improvements to chassis rigidity, handling, and ride quality. Overall, the SUV is 3.4 inches longer than the previous generation at 199.9 inches bumper-to-bumper -bumper with a 113.8-inch wheelbase, 2.8 inches longer than last year. The pilot's track has also increased by 1.1 inches at the front axle and 1.4 at the rear, but the overall body width of 78.5 inches is actually 0.1 inches narrower than before. Power 
powering the Pilot is a new 3.5-liter V6 engine that produces 285 horsepower and 262 pound-feet of torque. Yes, that's the same displacement as last year. Yes, the peak torque is the same, but Honda assures me that this is a new engine with a unique block and a new low-profile cylinder head. With 5 horsepower more than last year, it's the most powerful V6 Honda has ever offered in an SUV, but more importantly, the more compact design promises increased efficiency and emissions, though Honda hasn't released official estimates yet. Inside, the larger pilot benefits from more second and third row legroom, up 2.4 and 0.6 inches respectively, and more cargo capacity, with 22.4 cubic feet behind the third row, and up to 113.7 cubes with both rows folded flat. The Pilot is available in 8 and 7 passenger configurations, but the Touring and Elite trim levels feature a removable second row center section that gives you both. It flips up to form a triple cross bench seat, flips down to serve as a wide second row center armrest or pops out leaving a pass through to the third row. The removable section weighs about 35 pounds and snaps easily into place, although it's a little tricky to lift. There's even storage under the cargo floor, so you never have to leave the house without it. Trailsport features embossed logos on the headrests, all with the Trailsport branded floor mats, and contrast orange stitching on the dash and first two rows of seats. Trailwatch Trailsport camera mode engages the pilot's surround view camera and keeps the front camera active at low speeds for a better view of narrow passages and steep peaks. Go over 15 miles per hour and the camera is disabled, but the system will reactivate automatically if you slow down to 12 mph in trail mode, which is nice. Camera washers for the front and rear cameras are also standard for the Trail Sport trim. The 2023 Honda Pilot Trail Sport will begin production at the automaker's Lincoln, Alabama plant in December and reach dealers shortly thereafter. Pricing and economy haven't been announced yet, but we look forward to learning more in the coming weeks. Trail Sports Trail Mode also features unique all-wheel drive logic that helps it maintain traction when lifting the wheels off the ground. The combination of mechanical rear axle torque vectoring and front axle brake bias allows the IVTM4 system to send up to 75% of available axle torque to the grounded wheel, while the raised tires get the remaining 25%. Honda reckons that keeping the wheel revs up also makes it ready to smoothly accept power when it finally hits back down for a smoother ride experience. Trailsport marks the debut of hill descent control on the Pilot. It's adjustable between 2 and 12 miles per hour speeds and helped us tiptoe over bumpy road sections with ease. Another useful feature is the Trail Watch camera system that gives the driver a view of any underbody friction challenges ahead or anywhere else in the vicinity. 
In trail mode, the video feed automatically appears on the center touchscreen at under 15 miles per hour, and we appreciated the ability to switch between front, side, and 360 degree views using the button on the end of the windshield wiper shaft. Multiple camera views are like having a virtual rangefinder, although it's still helpful to get out and see sometimes. As Honda says its reveal is planned for this fall. It will then go on sale later this year or early next year, and we expect prices to start at around $40,000.